It's nice to meet you again. Last week is a week of decreasing. Follow us and keep yourself on track. The stainless steel market for last week got stuck in a continuous price drop. The reason is that the price increase was crazy in the former time. Stainless steel was not the only fall after the previous rise. The commodities also ended up with a long position. Without good support and enough confidence, people kept selling the long positions. Last week, the Kuro 304 of private owned mills in the Wuxi market dropped from $2,055 to $2,025. The price cut out $30, which is the biggest price fall since June when the price has begun to increase. As for 201, the price kept in the falling chain. Last week, the price of J2 decreased from $1,020 to $1,010. The price decrease of last week appears of two major concerns. First, the stock starts increasing. The production in September is enlarged. The production of 300 series rose by 31% compared to the production of last September. Many people worry about whether the extra products can be consumed in recent times. Worry comes for a reason. Last week, the stock of the Wuxi also increased, and the September products of Qingshan arrived on time. Second, the raw material price fell. The nickel price began to decrease. The purchasing price of ferro nickel is decreased to $169. As the ferro nickel routine, at the end of the year, the supply is used to increase, so the concern is lasting. In all, the price decreased. The profit stock in the spot market kept setting out, accelerating the decrease of stainless steel price, which is a symptom after the exaggerated increase of the recent two months. Mills are united to hold the price. Qingshan and Delong set a limited price to prevent a further drop. The stock volume in the Wuxi market is increasing. The contradiction of supply and demand began to show up. In this changing market, the more and advanced information you get, the better decisions you can make. Subscribe us to help you to see through the market. Any question or suggestion, leave your comments down below. See you soon next week. Bye-bye!